talk with Chris Wilson regarding one of our reporting tools, McLeod IQ. How are you doing, Chris? I'm doing well, Missy. How are you? Doing great. So your company utilizes our McLeod IQ tool. Barton Logistics, yeah, we were an early adopter. And how is it different from the standard reports you may have used in the past? I tell people who are unfamiliar with business intelligence, standard reports, whether they're spreadsheet or paper-based, are two-dimensional. And the cube is three-dimensional. And what that means is, is that the variables in the cube, we call them dimensions, are indexed to each other in such a way that we can slice and dice that uh, information in literally three dimensions. And so it's very useful for mining trends, spotting problems, and looking for things that are working really well and you want to go out and replicate that behavior. Sure. What about it do you like the most? Uh, it's infinite. It, it, it literally is infinite. If I can conceive of a way to cut data or a new data element to add that will allow me to track a trend a little tighter, uh, I can either go in and create what is called an MDX value, which is a calculated value, or I can call Clay up and say, hey, what do you think about, and here's why I'm asking. Good old Clay. Good old Clay. So what business impacts have you realized using the McLeod IQ? Well, we shifted our profit curves. So uh, when we look at how we earn margin on different shipments, different customers, different lane pairs, you would expect to see a standard distribution curve. Mm -hmm. um, good old statistics 101. Um, and so when I was able to track and measure that curve, how, how we peaked and where, uh, I was able then to start to ask questions about why. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, anybody who's um, versed as a black belt in lean technology understands five whys. And so you start asking five whys and you get down to the ultimate reason for a, re a result that you get. And so uh, I love that. And, and that has put money to our bottom line. Absolutely. So was there a, a large learning curve with learning how to tweak the McLeod IQ to get the information that you needed, or, or did you pick up fairly easy on it? So I was an early adopter, and I was taking information out of McLeod and building my own base spreadsheets. So when I came to Clay and started talking about this notion, I gave him my spreadsheet, and he went in and he pulled the data elements out of McLeod uh, and so very early on, it was just like using a pivot table. I, I like pivot tables. Sure. Excel is a fabulous mm -hmm. tool. Mm -hmm. And so I use pivot tables. It's a natural thing for me, like breathing. And, and so I was able to mount that data right to that pivot table, and I was off and running. There is very little um, by way of learning. It's very intuitive. It's, it's just it's like using an ATM. It's easy. Fantastic. So it's also great having then support back at McLeod to help kind of work with you on taking what you had in the past and using it now in this new tool that you can then take and expand. Well, you know customers. We like to think we know it all. But the reality is we see a very narrow slice, our reality. And so when I get to talk to the guys back at McLeod, right, they know I want to make the, the, the product better. And so we, the, the interaction, we, we bounce things off of each other. Um, I find a lot of times I'm listening more than I'm speaking to them because they've got a perspective that I really need to wrap my head around. Well, Chris, I'm glad you came to the conference and I assume you're seeing value in coming. And Yeah, yeah, we do. Um, the McLeod Conference offers me an environment to network with my peers and to trade best-in-class thinking with them. Uh, sometimes a notion or a sentence is all you need and it becomes the kernel of a great idea. And this is an environment where we can do that transparently. Um, and, and that's what I love about this conference. That's great. Chris, thanks for spending some time with us and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Take care. Lisa. tell everybody it's the best conference that we come to every year um, and I, I truly believe that you know there's uh, there's some other conferences that we attend but nothing allows us to expand from a TMS perspective as well as a networking perspective. I have a hands-on experience with the software. I can't put into words how much we've learned in, in, in this couple of days. It, 
it's just invaluable. I, I've met so many people from all across the country, uh, from Oregon, Chicago, uh, Illinois, of course, uh, Maine, Florida, that are in the same business that we're in, and I can share the same woes and agonies that we've had and find solutions. I, if I come out of here with one great idea, I'm thrilled, and usually I come out with two or three. Uh, it's worth every penny. We're very excited about the integration we've done with McLeod on both onboarding and khaki. Uh, onboarding is a wonderful tool that allows, allows carriers to really have the insights on, uh, from a broker perspective, finding the right carrier partners that meet their, their specific qualifications, have all the background information you could ever imagine for each carrier to make sure you have a better match and you're, you're choosing the right partners. Uh, with Khaki, Khaki is basically a carrier qualification management tool that again has uh, carrier ratings, it has all the carrier insurance information. Both these tools are all focused on making better decision and, and also forming better partnerships, connecting with the right individuals. Truck Shop does a uh, fantastic job with rate data. Rate's all about confidence, having the, the confidence from the inside sales, your broker teams on understanding where the market is. And same with carriers, they want to understand the market pulse which changes on a daily basis. So we've done a great job of partnering with McLeod to incorporate our rating tools, RateMate. Uh, we also have rate analysis and other rate uh, data that enables the, the um, entire brokerage or carrier to make better decisions, more informed decision-making tools. Really one decision on a, a rate can make or break the profitability of that load. So we want to make sure uh, the entire team feels confident with the decision-making process. It's something we're really excited about of having rate forecasting. Uh, we have a partnership with FTR, uh, Economist Group, that forecasts out on a, on a lane basis the um, projects forward 52 weeks. Load pay, if you think about the industry today, for a carrier side, uh, carrier's number one challenge is uh, their, their, their cash flow, managing their cash flow keeping their business healthy. Um, on the broker side, you think about the payment processing today and all the, the challenges that go about that with ACH payments, with uh, calls from carriers, where's my payment? Low pay basically uh, enables the, the entire marketplace to be more successful. So it's a uh, seamless ACH payment network, but also it's a it's built-in quick pay system. So a carrier can decide if they want to be paid on normal terms or if they want to be paid, pay me now today. So they click on a button on a per transaction basis and they're empowered to make that decision to better manage their cash flow.